All right, so we're doing ARCA series here at Charlotte. We have a viewer of the channel, new new viewer, Trevor here. So that's super cool. Uh, let's get this all started. We are, let me check. As long as everything's working properly, I'll give you your... Uh, yeah, we're way in the back. I shouldn't have even qualified because I ended up messing up my second lap like I seem to be doing. Seems to be a reoccurring thing here. But we're the number 14, so we do have some work to do. If we can get a top 10, like I always say, then I'll definitely be happy. feel like it's probably going to be messy. We have quite a few cars in this, 23 to be exact, so it's probably going to be a wreck fest. Uh, the car didn't feel too loose, felt too tight actually for the most part, so just with the brake bias and everything, we can probably knock it down even more here, because it just did not want to turn into the corner. Uh, let's do negative one for right now. Apparently I can't pace, so that's a thing. Alright. Obviously no tires, no fuel on this one. 35 laps, so... We'll have to make sure we take care of our tires, don't mess anything up. Biggest thing is don't slide. Especially in the corner because that's just going to heat them up. And from our past experience here, uh, it tends to make the car very loose when the tires heat up bad. And you can spin out after that. So, I'm going to take it nice and easy. Get a decent start. Outside. Have a nice little gap here, so I don't know what we want. Wow, that car is loose now, and we already have a spin on the back. Number two. That stinks for him. If he doesn't make it back, he's going to be losing quite a bit of I rating in this one. Besides that, we make it clean through lap one. And it looks like everybody's kind of separating here quite a bit. Brake bias is turned down as low as we can get it, 60%. Steering offset, I believe, is at plus 11, so... Helps turn into the corner just a bit. And I think our ratio is at 12 to 1. And the Home Depot car was in the infield there a bit, but luckily it recovers it. He's coming back up the track. We might have an incident here if the 19 doesn't slow it down for... Oh my god, what's he doing? Still there. That was close. Not sure what he was doing. I don't know if he got damaged or something, but he uh, he almost got spun there. So, gonna be five laps in soon, and we're in the 14th position. So not too bad. We're making our way up, along with saving our tires. Put it on relative here. Hopefully the car doesn't go too tight. I know right now we're severely under driving it because definitely could have taken that corner exit a lot quicker there. Or it gets a bit loose there. Thirty-one point one five six. 
just realized this guy's a Dunder Mifflin paint scheme that's awesome. From the office. Cool part is, uh, it's from Scranton, Pennsylvania, and that's actually where I'm from. So, not where we're currently living, but where we used to live. And definitely watch that show a lot. Pretty funny. Apparently, Dunder Mifflin's gonna block me. That's fine, I think we have enough speed to get around them here. But I don't want to be too aggressive and do something stupid and potentially take us both out here, so... We'll just wear them down. By the time he goes high, we go low. Clear. Yeah, that bottom line's kind of hard to run. Especially to make a pass. Try and get closer to his back bumper again, because these guys behind me are starting to come. I don't want to lose any more positions or anything. And he's gonna get in front of me again here. If we can trick him to run that low line, we might be able to get by him. Outside. Out there. Try and get a better run off the corner here. Still outside. Still out there. Hopefully we'll get him here. Be close. Definitely Still putting up outside. a fight. Oh, this better not go three wide. Still there. It's going to go three wide, and I'm not having a part of that. Because there we go, we would have gotten taken out. And we'll come back around here on the bottom. I don't know what this eight's doing. He's kind of being a little more aggressive than I want right now. Still out there. Jeff Gordon paint scheme is coming up on our side here. Oh, oh, there it is. There's contact. Outside. I knew that was coming. Still outside. Clear. Well, the eight should be quicker than us, so Negative. hopefully we can just follow him now. The main problem was getting by the 19 there. So if we can run with a 19, get away from this group behind us, we should be able to get to this next group here. I'm honestly shocked they didn't wreck. That was very close. Let's see, the 17's a lap down, so hopefully he just lets us by. Eight's into the wall. Jeff Gordon behind this, he is into the wall as well. And he's going backwards after that. I 
trying to get back on the gas just a little bit sooner here. We're not yet halfway in this one, so... God, he just lands into that wall, and that's going to bring him back now. So I will gladly take that position. to try and run that bottom line because it's working extremely well for the 12 here. Let's try and run his line and see how it works for us. Definitely helps in four, turn four, with getting out of the corner. Yeah, he's able to get it down. Oh my god. Oh boy, that almost ended the 12's night. Outside. Corner clear. And we have another guy in the wall bouncing off of it extremely hard. Yeah, I think I'm just going into the turns just a little too quick. Gotta get it slowed down sooner. We already knew the 8 was quicker than us. He just hit the wall sooner. Which caused him to go backwards there. We'll see how this works for us. Yeah, these guys are just way quicker. Try and run our brake bias even lower here. Hopefully, be able to get a turn quicker. Bro, what the fuck are you doing? Oh my god, and that's them wrecking behind me. So I don't think we have to worry about losing any more positions. The biggest thing now is just to try it move a bit forward. Oh my god, and we have a wreck on the back straightaway now. That's going to be quite a few positions. Don't know if Trevor was in that or not. Didn't look like it. But that was certainly the leaders. Well, that's going to make our race a little more interesting. We're in the 12th now. Let's just try and run our line. See if we can catch these guys. I don't see how I've really worn out my tires. Been driving pretty conservatively, to be honest. I think that's going to be a bit quicker there. We were able to keep it up to 152 in the corner. Yeah, it just pushes. Let's not want to turn. 
I assume the number two is going to pass us. He is catching on us extremely quick. And it looks like he's running that high side. Yeah, I definitely have to reevaluate my line here. This is the first race up down here this week, so. About 10 laps to go, I think. Definitely need to see what other guys are doing. And try and figure out a better line. That's usually how it goes, though. Usually, first race of the week doesn't go that well. And when I do come back, we tend to be a bit quicker. So yeah, he's going to get by us fairly easy. Nineteen's a lap down, so I don't know if he's gonna try and pass me. Point nine two two on the bottom inside. Still there. Clear low. Overdrives that corner just a bit, and he has to slow down quite, quite a bit there. And it stinks because I think we can catch the 16, but I don't know in six laps. actually wreck each other out there. 32.945 With them fighting like that, it's going to slow them down if I don't drop like a rock here. I'd love to see the right front after this, because it has to be pretty low. That's 16. Doesn't look like the 11's going to be able to catch us either, so should be able to get 13th place finish here. Not really the best, but pretty much where we're supposed to be. Feels like that right front's down to 50% or something, because it just does not want to turn. 
Especially when we go high, that's going to be really bad, actually. If I get another lap like that, the 11 might actually catch me. Under Mifflin is bouncing off the wall here. One point three. Thirty-three point three seven one. As long as I can get it to turn, we should be fine. Let's just keep it down low here. Yeah, he didn't even gain as much that time. God, and they're wrecking here at the end. Checkered this time. And that's going to count towards their safety rating. Because right, it doesn't stop a, counting it until that's at zero. Alright, well, let's see the incidents. See exactly what happened here. And let's see, where did... Oh wow, yeah, he came in third, nice job. Oh, let's see. Oh, he's already gone. All right, well, let's see everything that happened here. Because we definitely had some incidents. All right. 23 hitting the wall. Twenty just riding the wall. I'm guessing thirteen's gonna he just blinks out. Fifteen tap on the wall. Oh my god. Alright, well the seventeen absolutely gets plowed over. But he also was going extremely slow. I don't know what happened, what was wrong with his car. If he has a tire down or something. Doesn't look like it. I don't know what he was doing. <laughs> that makes no sense. But I'm sure the 23 has damage now. gonna have quite a few laps where people are just hitting the wall and then we have that big one on the back when he hitting the wall and this is where he loses multiple positions in that one Yeah, I don't know if the 17's on a controller or something, but he is all over the place. Twenty-three hitting the wall. Oh my god, twenty gets spun it looks like. Yeah, it appears like it, and that takes out Dunder Mifflin then. God, take it. This is the leader. And then, what even happened? What is going on? And then we have our bunch up here of just everyone. This almost looks. What happened? So the one hits the 23, or it doesn't. 23 is in the way of the leaders. The one slows down, doesn't want to hit him. And then he's riding the bottom. I don't know if the 5 feels bad because of what happened to the 1, but then the 23 hits the 5. 
And then we bunch up here. The 21 and 11 get together. Three get taken out in that. And then it's just complete disaster from there. Yeah, that was odd. And the rest of these are probably just going to be wall taps. Yeah, I don't... <laughs> Dang, that was an extremely hard hit. H is tapping the wall. I don't even know. Four hitting the wall, then he comes across the infield there. The one I'm guessing is going to hit the wall. The one runs over the six, and then this was actually at the end of the race. Yeah, these guys got plenty of incident points for that as well. Because it doesn't stop counting until the last guy crosses the finish. And that's it. So, not the best race, but we'll be back. Reevaluate what we did wrong. Uh, I think it's definitely just overdriving in the corner. Let's see what the tire was at. 54, that's what I was saying it was around. Doesn't really felt like it. Uh, all the other tires are fine, so definitely our driving style. I think we need to put more emphasis on our right rear, trying to get the car to turn uh, mid corner. That way, it doesn't eat away on our right front so hard. But thanks for watching, everyone, and I'll see you guys in the next one.